Hi, are you Agna? Who wants to know? Hi, I'm John. Whoa! It's okay, it's okay. I come in peace. Well, what can I do for you? I'm looking for some information. I heard you could help me. Well, you heard wrong. Now leave. I need to know about hybrids. Hybrids? They do not exist. Now please leave. Agna, I know you've been around for centuries delivering unwanted children from werewolves and vampires. I need your help. I know nothing. Now please leave. Agna, this boy's in trouble. I need, I need your help. His name's Roman. If you don't help him, he's gonna die. Roman? Of all the wolves you could have chose to frame for Kayla's murder, why did you choose Roman? Listen, we agreed to choose a wolf. We didn't specify which wolf. And ain't Roman a wolf? And then ain't he was about to turn? Perfect plan to me. Some plan. The real question is, why y'all break him out before he was due to be executed? What y'all want with him? I can't say. What? We supposed to be in this together. We both agreed to take the throne away from our brothers by killing the heirs. And I've been all in. I killed Caleb, and I let y'all kill my brother LP. Now you hold him back? But you missed him there. Roman's my brother's son. What? But Roman a wolf. You are right. He is a wolf. And a vampire. He's a hybrid. Damn. So John was right. Well, that's enough for you to tell him the throne. Your brother broke y'all out. You right. Even if I challenge him, I still wouldn't be king. While Marion is still alive, he's still head of the throne. Well, set him up. I zip. And another thing, since I'm doing all these favors, why are still breathing? I basically delivered her to you. Yeah, but before I could kill her, your brother showed up. I wasn't expecting him. I could have died, and I lost a good soldier. Damn, that's on me. I'll make sure you catch her alone next time. But look, my brother no longer believes Roman killed Caleb. It's raising suspicion. Keep your eyes and your ears open. We might be exposed. Say less. <sighs> Reggie, listen. I'm tired of lying. It's time we tell him the truth. He deserves to know the truth. He almost died before even knowing who he really was. We gotta tell him the truth today. Tell me what? Roman, I've been meaning to talk to you. I've been meaning to talk to you too. Look, I appreciate the hospitality and all, and you breaking me out of jail, even though I still don't know why you did it. Me and my mom have been here for way too long. So I think it's time we bounce. Come on. Roman, I mean, wait. We need to tell you something. Tell me what? Roman, many, many years ago, I met this girl named Elise. So, when we have a baby, what we gonna name her? Her? Yes, her. Why you think it's gonna be a girl? Well, what make you think it's gonna be a boy? Because I know these things. How you know? Because I know. Well, if we do have a boy, what we gonna name him? I think we should name him Roman. Why Roman? Because the Roman Empire was one of the most powerful empires that ever existed. Hmm, I like that, I like that. But uh, speaking of family, like how you plan on starting a family if I never even met your family? Uh, <laughs> you, you gonna be my family like really, really, really soon. I mean, really soon, okay? Um, but look, you know, I care about you, right? Yeah, I care about you too. Yeah, so. Oh, oh, that is. Get back. Please, get back. You okay? I think so. You sure? Yeah. I, what was that? Those were vampire bats. They are extremely poisonous. Really? Come on, we gotta get back to base. All right. Oh. Hey, 
think I got bit. You okay? I don't know. I think I think so. Uh, 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 Reggie! My father's losing his mind. Wolves in our castle, and Roman at that. What is he thinking? Well, maybe your father's right, bro. Maybe Roman didn't kill Caleb. Well, who did? His own pack believes he did it. He still hasn't turned. Hey, yo, I got the drop. I'm sending location now. So even if he didn't kill Caleb, he killed the vampire, and that gives me plenty enough reason to kill him. But what if he didn't kill anyone? That still doesn't explain why he still hasn't turned. Look, bro, I don't know about all that, but I know your father wants to be helping this man if he kills your brother or another vampire. Your father's a legend. He may be a legend, but his time of ruling has probably come to an end. But what is you saying? My uncle says I should challenge my father to the throne. Bro, is you crazy? That's pure suicide. Only if he chooses to kill me. My father wouldn't kill me. Look, bro, you never get in between the king and his throne. Well, anyway, what are we doing out here anyway? My uncle told us to meet him at this location. Who are you? That's what I'm talking about, nephew. That was just a little test. You passed. On the way to be the king. Who is that? Don't worry about that. Y'all two go home, I'll clean this up. Go. Failed to do the job. Stupid mutt. Agna! Agna! Help! What is wrong? He's been bit by a vampire bat. Okay, let him here. Let him here. What happened? They bombarded us. They were everywhere. But I'm sorry. There is nothing that I can do. He's going to die. Agnes, please, you gotta help him. It's gotta be something you can do. The vampire bin has it has spread it, and I, there's nothing that I can do. It has taken over his body. No, no, please help. Okay, okay. There's only one way that I can save him from the bite of a bat. What? It's natural immunity to the venom, and I do know one person that can save him. Okay, let's do it. Okay, you must be warned. It will save his life, but he will also lose it. What? There's no time to explain. You have to leave, because the person that's going to save him, she will kill us both if she knew I was helping a werewolf. Uh. If you don't push you and the baby, we're both gonna die. Push. I'm trying, I'm trying. Try harder, try harder. Why is he not crying? I'm trying. Is he I'm okay? Kaya, okay. give me my baby. He didn't my make baby. it. He didn't make it. What do you mean? He didn't make it. What do you mean he didn't make it? He's right here. It's fine. I'm gonna give you some it's time. It's okay. Yeah. He's okay. Hey, my baby. Oh. <laughs> you to save him. He was bitten by a vampire bat, and the venom is spreading through his body. Where did it bite him? On his neck. A human. And a bat bit a human? Where was he? He was in the forest. I don't know. He just came in for the forest. I just tried to help. It's not certain that I can save him if he was bit by a vampire bat. The only ones that can be saved is unless he was chosen. Even if I could save him, do he know what he will become? Doesn't matter, he just wants to live. He smells like a dog in here. You really should clean up. Hmm. He's really cute. He smells delicious. 
suspicious. Maybe I'll just drain his blood for myself. Just help him, please. He must live. If I can control myself. I'm controlled. Thank you. Thank you. He will turn soon. And he's going to be ready to feed. If I was you, I wouldn't be here. Get away from me! I promise I will whip you to pieces! What's going on? What's all that noise? Is that Tora? Kaya, what's going on? It's not good. The baby was stillborn. Really? Oh my God. I gotta go in there. No, no. She's already attacked two guards. She's gone crazy. She Look. thinks the baby is still alive. Look, that's my best friend. I'm going in there. <sighs> hey, uh, it's me, your best friend. Can I, can I come in? Yes. Come around the front. Okay. Hey. Hey. My God, he is so beautiful. Ain't he, girl? Yes. He's gonna be strong and big like his father. <laughs> you know, he's all I have left of his father. I really wish he was still here. I know. If he was here, he'll be so proud of you guys. Yeah. I don't know what happened. It's okay. I don't know how this happened. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Don't cry. It's alright. It's alright. It's okay. I hope he's okay. I mean, since the bat bite and everything, I, I, I feel so alive. I mean, hell, whatever type of medicine that lady gave me was great. I feel so alive. I ain't never felt this good. Look, let me show you. Watch this. Uh, he don't know. He don't know who I am. I gotta tell him. Did you see that? Did you see how fast I ran? <laughs> this is crazy. You see that? Uh, I'm assuming Agnes didn't tell you. Uh, tell me what? Me and my family are werewolves. <laughs> At least stop playing. Ain't no such thing as werewolf. Look. How you do that? Look, you were bit by a vampire bat. The venom spread very quickly. I didn't have a choice. I uh, didn't know what to do. What happened? What, what you mean? What you saying? Technically, you're a vampire now. What you mean, technically, I'm a vampire now? Agnes is not a lady. She's a witch. And in order to save you, she had to get a vampire to bite you and turn you into a vampire. Wait. Y'all turn me into a vampire? It was the only way we could save you. I don't care, you should have just let me die then. You gonna turn me into a monster? I couldn't just sit there and let you die. I had to make a decision. It wasn't your decision to make. <laughs> but, look, I, I don't Touch me. Stop, Stay hey, away from Reggie. me, man. Let me go. Stop! <laughs> oh. <laughs> Witch, what have you done to me? I saved your life. I didn't ask for this. You was not in the position to ask for anything. Turn me back, now! It cannot be done. <sighs> Listen, I have saved your life. You are the chosen one. You have to lead. It cannot be done. I don't want to be chosen. You don't have a choice in the matter. <sighs> Listen, you are the chosen one. You will be ruler over many. What was that? 
Elise. Ugh. Where have you been? Father's been looking all over for you. I don't care. Leave me alone. Rumor has it that this guy that you've been talking to, he's converted to vampire. You need to stay away from him. You my brother. You are not my father. You don't tell me what to do. Man, don't be stupid. The pack will kill you if they find out. I don't care. Let me go. All right. Have it your way. I'm going to tell father. Just blasphemy. <sighs> Telling me what I can and can never, never, never have another uh, human again. Something is wrong. Uh, no. You have uh, to leave. Go. Uh, Why do you keep coming here? Do you have uh, doctors and nurses of your own? Why are you treating me like this? Your boyfriend came and tried to rip my head off because he's a vampire now. He'll, he'll be okay. He'll get used to it. He will never get used to it. Uh, something is wrong. Uh, 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 uh. What is wrong? It's my stomach. Uh, you are, you're a pregnant child. What? What? Is it Reggie? Of course. When did you conceive? Less than an hour ago. It has two heartbeats. This is uh, remarkable. This has never happened before. This is rare. Uh, You're pregnant with a hybrid. A what? A hybrid. Half uh, vampire and half werewolf. Uh, Reggie must not be a full vampire in order for this to happen. Uh, oh my God. Uh, what? I'm pregnant with a vampire's baby? They're gonna kill me. Please, get this out of me. No, you have having a hybrid. Hold on, let me check. Let me read the book. It says uh, here that the hobby grows really, really fast, and you can have it at any time now. What? Cut this out of me, child. Are you not listening to me? You can die. Uh, and plus, the hobby will not live past to a couple of days anyway. Uh, uh, where are you going? Uh, where, where I gotta are you go going? find Reggie. No, are you not listening? You can die. You can go into labor. Are you not listening? Uh, uh, uh. Elise. Oh, I gotta get to Agnes. Elise, where you been disappearing to? None of your business. Your little boyfriend came around here. Some guys from the pack, they ran him off. And judging by how fast he was moving, he's definitely a vampire. Reggie, where is he? I forbid you to see him. You won't get yourself killed, Elise. I don't care. I take care of this myself. Uh, what is this? Uh, you pregnant? Uh, with a vampire, baby? Oh, you fool! Alone. You brought shame to this family. Let me go! They're gonna kill you and your unborn child. I'll take care of the baby myself. Move! <laughs> 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 Who are you? Well, that's a lovely way to say thank you for somebody saving your life again. But I'm Kanikra. You want to know? A vampire? No, we are vampires. One of those were werewolves that was just about to tear you apart. And seeing that you're still alive, that means that bat chose you. So, I'm Kanikra. And you Reggie. may want to come with me, Reggie. Introduce you to some people. You have to push. You need to push. One, two, three. Push! Push, child! Push! Push! Push now! I'm gonna push, child. It's here! It's a boy! It's a boy! Oh my gosh! Let me see him. What are you going to name him before he dies? Roman. 
Oh. Elise, where are you? That's I know you're in his witch cave He's somewhere. He's gonna kill him. Take him. Elise. Hide him. Oh. Elise, where are you? I know you're here. Where is it? Give him to me. No! Give him to me now! If I won't, stop! <laughs> That means the Alpha killed his own sister. Roman's his nephew. Calm down. Elise is dead. Dead? How? She died after childbirth. Pregnant? She was pregnant? Yes. I don't have time to explain now. Time is of the essence. But you have a second uh. chance of being a mother. Please. Give me my baby. No, no, no. Listen. Your baby is dead. No. She's, she's dead. But you have a second chance to honor your friend, okay? Come on. I don't have time now. Time is of the essence. I will bury your baby, okay? What's his name? His name? It's Roman. Hey, Roman. You look just like your mom. I'll take good care of you. I'll take care of you. Although I lost my firstborn son that day, I gained one too. Wait, so you're not my real mom? Not means. Yes, Roman. I'm your father. You're Roman's father? How'd you know I was here? I'm your father. I was thinking back to that night when werewolves slaughtered my entire village. I mean, there were only three of them, but the men of our village didn't stand a chance. The way they was tossed around, like they were nothing. My parents tried to protect me and Caleb. Then you came with the snap of your fingers. Just like that, all of it was over. And at that moment, that's when I knew I wanted to be a vampire, just like you. Then you took me and Caleb in as your own sons. I felt so close to you. I would have did anything for you. You were everything to me. But now, I don't even know who you are. I sometimes come to these fields to remind myself that you're not even my father. Omari, listen, why? Everything you told me was a lie. You said vampires and werewolves don't mix. Then how you explain Roman, huh? Marion, 
I was human once. What? Years before I met you and Caleb. I was a human. I met this girl. We fell in love. One thing led to another. I, I, I didn't even know she was a, a wolf until she had been killed. But by that time, the damage was done. That's when my hatred for wolves started. I didn't hate her because she was a wolf, but because she lied to me, I felt deceived. And most of all, I hated her because I blamed her for being turned into a vampire. So where did that leave me? Now that Roman, your biological son, is here, am I all to you nothing but an adopted son? Marion, it's not like that. Am I still out to the throne? I thought so. Man, I am sick of being in the house. You wanna go to the park or something? No, Mom said we gotta stay in the house until her and Ty get back from the blood bank. For what though? Like, I just wanna go outside. I'm finna suffocate in this room. Tay, we are in the middle of a war, that's why. And besides, you're supposed to be taking care of me. Because you know, I'm <laughs> sick. <laughs> Girl, you just do do too much. You're just a big baby, ain't nothing even wrong with you. Oh, you don't love me anymore. Love. That's it, I'm leaving. Tay, where are you going? Mom said we gotta stay put. I'm going to the park. You're worrying too much, Sarah. I'll be back before they do. Um, where's my black pullover? I think Ty was wearing it, yeah. Right, oh, okay. Well, guess I'm gonna wear yours. <laughs> Give me back! I'll be back. Bye, love you. Love you too. How was my mom? I mean, my other mom, Elise. She was beautiful, inside and out. Now she was stubborn like you, but she was also fearless like you. And she was my best friend. And she was so in love with your father that she cared who she really was. So I guess lies do really run in the family. Now Roman, listen, I'm sorry I lied to you, but it was only to protect you. From what? The truth? Listen, it's something I didn't tell you. Not even your father knows this. What? <sighs> Mom, listen. If you expect me to forgive you, no more lies. No more secrets. Okay. Your mom was accidentally killed by her brother, the Alpha. What? Yes. Agnes witnessed it all. Now listen, I haven't told anyone what I've just told you here today. It's a deadly secret and the Alpha will do anything to protect it. So be careful, okay? Mm -hmm. Hold on, chill, chill. I come in peace. Yeah, right. Wait, wait, I'm, I'm a friend of, of Sarah's. You know my sister? Yeah, you uh, Tatiana, right? No, she's the dumb one. I'm Tay. Oh, yeah, Tay. Uh, I'm TD. Oh! Well, now I found you. <sighs> mm-hmm. TD, what you want? Um, I was... I wanted to talk to you about Sarah. I kind of care about her. You kind of care about her? Look, I love her, all right? But she... She loves someone else. <laughs> Roman? That's him. <laughs> okay, so what do you want me to do about it? With you being her big sister, I was hoping you could uh, lead her in the right direction. And Roman ain't gonna do nothing but get her hurt. Look, when a vampire's in love, it's nothing you could do about it. 
Once you're attached to somebody, you just can't get unattached. Man, tell me about it. Heart won't what it won't. But he's a werewolf. Like I said, the heart won't what it wants. Man, this one nothing but a waste of time. TD, keep your heart open. Love will find you again. What can I do for you? I can't talk to you about Omarion. I ain't heard from him in a few days. I was trying to make sure he was good. Omarion had some trouble dealing with some issues, but he's strong. He'll be okay. Yeah, last time I talked to Chauncey, he said they was attacked by a werewolf. Chauncey told you that him and Omarion was attacked by a werewolf? Yeah, but they said Dayon came and saved him and killed the werewolf. So Dayon knew? Yeah. They said he said that it was for some type of test or something. A test? What was that? What you talking about, the uh, the other night? The guy you sent that came empty-handed when you know these young boys slang iron. Man, hold up. He was a good soldier. He been a top hitter for years. Matter of fact, how many was there? Two. So you lied to me. You told me it was just gonna be Omarion now. You had me send my man on a suicide mission. I guess we even now. How we even and Iris still breathe? I told you I'm on it. Now wait on my call. Blood sucker. Tay, Tay, what are you? I'm tired of covering up for you, okay? You're gonna get me in trouble and I don't even have time for mom. Tay! No, you're here, hello? Tay? Tay, why are you laying on the ground? Get up. Tay! Tay? Tay, get up! Tay! Tay! No. Oh, Tay, get up, please, Tay, get up. Tay, get up, please, who did this? Hey, I did something for you yesterday. I hope I made you proud. You know, a lot of people think that death is the worst thing that can 
ever happened to you? No. The worst thing that can happen to you is losing the person that you love, your soulmate, the person you can be yourself around and love and trust. That's why I'm doing all of this, for you. I want them to feel my pain. I want them to feel your pain. You took the person I love away from me. I'm going to take his. I'm going to make sure they remember you. You'll be impossible to forget anyway. Just continue resting in power until we meet again. Hey, that favor I owe you, consider it done. I'll call you in an hour with the location. she's really gone. It doesn't even feel real. I remember when I was afraid of heights, she took me to the forest and climbed me up the tallest tree and left me there and told me if I wanted to get down, I have to get myself down. Wow. Really? Yeah. I stood up there crying for like 18 hours until I realized she wasn't going to come get me down. When I climbed down, she was waiting at the bottom for me. She said if I fell, she was going to catch me. And that's how I conquered my fear of heights. Man, that's deep. Yeah, that's Tay. Ty used to tease her and call her stupid, but Tay was really smart. Speaking of Tatiana, how is she taking Tay's death? She's taking it really hard. She stays in her room and she doesn't come out at all. Hey. But anyway, I gotta get ready for her funeral. Are you gonna be there? Yeah, of course. I'll do whatever it takes to be there for you. All right, see you later. See you. I killed Seraph, then yes, I killed her. What you want me to do now? Bring her head? Seraph? Seraph's not dead. Yes, she is. I, I killed her myself. <laughs> oh, that was you? Nah. You killed Tay, Seraph's sister. No, I killed Seraph. I tracked her down, I smelled her scent, and she was with TD. It, it, was, it was Seraph. I know. Look, never mind that. I'm not here for that. Then why am I here? If you're trying to get any information from me, then you might as well go ahead and kill me. <laughs> information? Do you know who I am? I don't need anything from you. Then why am I here? You're here because your uncle wants you dead. Who, my, my uncle J-Mac? <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> See, you don't know as much as you think you do. You're the only thing standing between J-Mac and him being here to the throne. The throne? I don't even want the throne. Doesn't matter. He wants you dead, just to be sure. I see. What I don't understand is why the brother of a king would want to help some backstabbing wolf. Quid pro quo. Favor for a favor. See, I don't care about him no more than I care about you. We just have something in common, that's all. It's true. I saw him. I knew this day would happen. He must have been plotting this for years. They is convinced that he's the rightful heir to the throne. And you know what? He may be right. That's true. But the past is the past. You're right. But try telling him that. He's my brother, and I love him, but he's a traitor to the throne. And for that, he must die. I agree. You know what? I'm convinced that him and J-Max started this whole war as a distraction to their plot. Now that I think about it, they may even be responsible for killing Caleb. 
I want to do the old wolf know where our younger brother's been up to. Maybe it's time that we pay him a visit. I'll never understand how the hunger for power will make men go against their own flesh and blood. Wrong again, young pup. <laughs> you want to know a secret? Me and Reggie are not even real brothers. He's not even an original vampire, and he definitely doesn't have royal blood, but I do. Wait, how? See, the throne was stolen from my family centuries ago. I'm the last of the dragon riders. Wait, you're a dragon rider? Yes, I'm second generation. I heard about y'all. Y'all have one of the most powerful dynasties ever, right? That's true. The Varkalos was the most powerful until our last dragon died from being poisoned. That's until the Zuna dynasty betrayed us. They came in at our weakest, killed our entire army, and slaughtered my whole family. Wait, really? Yeah. Since I was so young, they enslaved me and used me as leverage, just in case another dragon rider came about. That's when Reggie came into power, granted me my freedom, and accepted me as his brother. Dang. So you just gonna betray him after he gave you your freedom? The freedom was mine. He shouldn't have had to give it to me in the first place. I'm the rightful heir to the throne. And I'm not finna keep pretending like I'm some brother to the king. And he's not gonna give it to me. So I gotta take it. was murdered, right? That's why they're here. I'm sorry. I didn't mean it like that. But it's just, I feel like food when they're around is kind of creepy. Maybe you should leave for like a few hours until it's over. Leave. Leave my house. You can scatter them. That's one thing about being scared. But the second thing is being foolish. You just need to go. Tay was like my daughter too. So... I'll just take care of things in here, and you go be with your, with your folks. Oh, no. Okay, cool. You can handle it. Maybe you should make them some nachos or something. Maybe the vampires want some chip and dip. Maybe that's what you can do. Maybe so. I, I, I make nachos. How about you do that? I don't care what you do. Just leave me alone. All right. Hey, wait up. I'm going with you guys. No, son. You need to sit this one out. What? Let me guess. You don't want the vampires to know that you fell in love with the werewolf and got a half three months, son? Well, look, I'm not going for you. I'm going for Seraph. Look, if you really love that girl, you'll sit this one out. so warm anymore, but can we get out of here, go outside or something? Yeah, that's cool. I want to talk to you anyway. You know, thank you for coming here. I always feel alone being here, so thank yeah. you. Yeah, I'm sorry for your loss. Yeah, me too. You know, before all this even happened, I had talked to her that day. Really? What for? About us. I hate that that happened to her. Did you see anyone? Did she feel like she was in danger or needed help? No. She didn't say anything.
But don't you worry about this. Whoever did this, I'll find them. Me too. But where's everybody going? Hold on. I, I gotta go talk to my mom about this. I'll see you later. Mm -hmm. Sarah, don't worry about me. I'm fine. Go check on your sister. Hey, Ty. How you feel? How do I feel? How do I feel? Did you know that ever since Tay was born, she has never been by herself? Like, never. I've always been there. And the one time, the one time I'm not by her side, this happens? And you. Seraph, how could you be so stupid? If I was there, she would still be alive. You stupid little cowbird. <laughs> Ty, you're suffocating me. I can't breathe. Now you see how I feel. Now get out! I see you found the little. Look, I don't know why you keeping it alive. That's your business, that's your family. I'm about to slide. Hey, Dale, one more thing. What's up? That's for ELP. Story about the scorpion and the frog. You know the scorpion died, right? It is what it is. So you the reason Puncho died, huh? Why are you here? Wheezy, how you been? I've been better. I can help you with some of that. Nah, I got it, but still, why are you here? You're the only person I can turn to. You must be in some real trouble if I'm the only person you can turn to. Sarah, baby, are you okay? I just miss Tay. I miss her too. But guess what? We gonna get through this. Because we are a strong family. And as long as we're together, everything's gonna be okay. Ma, is Ty right though? You think if I would've went to the park with her, she still would've been alive? No, Seraph. Listen, Ty, Ty is just hurting. Her and Tay was so close, all right? And hurt people hurt other people. You just happen to be convenient. That's it. Oh my, what if I would have went? Maybe I could have done something or help. I just can't think that she could have had a better chance. Maybe, maybe not. Or if you would have went and you would have helped her, maybe both of you would be dead. And then I'll be mourning two daughters instead of one. Or hey, maybe you would have died instead and Tay lived. 
And then Tay would be sitting here like you are, blaming herself. The only fault to Tay's death is this stupid war. That's who fault it is. You're right. Let me get the door. Are you still having a hard time getting off his death, huh? Yeah. I mean, he's the only thing I can think about. I can't seem to think of anything else anyway. I feel like I'm going crazy or something. You're not going crazy, all right? Well, what is it then? And why am I the only person that avenges his death? Don't you care about him? Of course I do. A puncher was my little brother. I think about him every day. But really, it's just the cost of war. But the reason you going so hard is because y'all imprinted on each other. Imprinted on each other? Yeah. It's the mark of love. When two wolves find their soulmate, they mark each other. Really, it's nothing else like it. Wait, so that mean I'm gonna feel like this forever? Only if you allow yourself to. First, you gotta get control of yourself. If you don't, you're gonna keep on making reckless moves. Wait, so what am I supposed to do about my uncle? Now that he know that I know what he's been up to, he ain't gonna stop until I'm dead. That's your decision. But I tell you this, life is like chess. Your next move should always set up your next move. How do I look? Man, you look just like your father. <laughs> but nah, for real though, I thought this would be my life one day. I'd sit on the throne, you'd be by my side, we'd kill wolves and marry beautiful brides. Well, bro, we could still kill wolves and marry beautiful brides. That's not enough. I want it all. Hey, uh, have you seen Dad? I mean, Reggie? Nah, you're right. He ain't your dad. As a matter of fact, you're just a mutt, a mistake. It'll be better if you just disappear. Man, whatever. Have you seen him? I need to talk to him about something. Uh, uh, hold that thought. I think the last place I seen him was in, in my pocket. Let me see. I'm sorry, man, I lost him. Okay, whatever. If you do see him, tell him I'm looking for him. I don't look like a damn messenger. Do it yourself. Whatever, bro. Bro? I ain't your bro. I'm a vampire. You're just, you're just a mutt. Trash. Don't ever call me that again. Whatever. You know how I did see last night? Sarah. And I was with her last night. <laughs> you know who I seen? Who? His mother. You know, maybe I'll hook up with her and we'll make a mutt ourselves. She's like to throw so much, make sure it's real nice, real nice and comfortable, huh? Maybe I should just melt you into it. What's the matter? Cat got your tongue? My fault, bro. Make sure you tell Reggie I'm looking for him. told me everything. Oh, yeah? I want to thank you for saving her life, brother. She told me they uh, kidnapped her and had her tied up. And you tracked them down and you killed them. I just want to say thank you. I don't know what I would have did. It's nothing, bro. That's what we supposed to do. We family. <laughs> right. Family. Family more important than anything. You are all I got left. I love you, brother. I love you too. Hey there. You can talk to Uncle J-Max for a second. Sure. You know what? You're getting too good at this. What you up to? Keep your friends close, but your enemies closer? Oh, just gonna let you off easy, huh? Nope. From now on, whatever I say goes. Got it? So whatever I tell you to do, you do. But I got something for you. 
I'll make sure I stay around. And you, make sure you stay out of trouble. Dang, all packed up here, ain't it? Plan on going somewhere? It's gonna stay here for a little longer. Trap, to what do we owe this pleasure? I would like to report a crime. What is it? It's about Conegra. She has committed treason against our kind. You're speaking of Conegra, the daughter of King Lorenza? Yes. You do realize that she's of royal blood. Anything that's brought to this council will be recorded. And if we find it to be untrue, you will be executed. I do. State your claim. Again! Why are you going so hard? Is this about Roman? How did he get so powerful? Bro, he's a hybrid. So? You should have seen me last night. I was helpless. I never felt so helpless in my life. I mean, the power gap between us is pitiful. I'm a vampire, the son of a king. I don't ever want to feel like that again. So we're going to train till our limbs fall off. Again. The king's inside. He's been waiting for you. You, wait out here with me. Give me a reason why I shouldn't jump across this table and rip your head off. Because you and I both know it won't be that easy. Now please, have a seat. When was the last time you saw your brother, J-Mac? It's none of your business. But I can tell you, I haven't seen my brother LP since I sent him to deliver that message to you. Oh yeah, LP. Yeah, he caught me at a bad time. I was grieving the death of my son, who coincidentally was killed when LP came to pay me a visit. LP didn't kill your son. Yeah, I know that now. But it was your other brother, J-Mac. You see, him and my brother, Dayon, have been plotting to take the throne away from both of us. They started this whole war as a ploy. Well, obviously it ain't go as planned. <laughs> your brother is dead. Yeah, my brother J-Mac killed him. And I'm still alive. See, my brother Lloyd to me, and your brother, he a fool for conspiring with a wolf. And next time I see you, I won't be so pleasant. Bro, at least tell me where my brother's body is so I can bury him. TD the other night? What? You heard me. Were you with him? Did you mean at my sister's funeral? Yeah, he came. We talked. What's the big deal? What's the big deal? Do you not remember this fool and his cousin trying to freaking kill me? What's the big deal? I thought I told you to stay away from him. You don't tell me what to do. He came to the funeral to pay his respects. We talked about Tay and that's it. Speaking of, why weren't you there? I told you I needed you. I don't get it. You, you wouldn't understand. You don't know what I understand, Roman. At least TD was there for me. Don't do that. You don't get to do that. Do what? Compare me to him. I'm not him, okay? You know what? I'll tell you what. I'll make things easy for you. Choose him. 
because I'm out. Is that Dayon? Dayon. Unk. Unk. Dad, he isn't breathing. What happened? Who did this? He did it to himself. What do you mean he did it to himself? He wouldn't do this to himself. How did you even know he was here? Two surprising visits in two days. I'm on the road, huh? Weez, how have you been? I'm good, old friend. What can I do for you? Tell me, when the last time you talked to J-Mac? Honestly, before yesterday? It's been a while since I talked to anybody. I've been hearing some very disturbing news about him. I don't want to believe it, hmm. but my wolf instinct telling me otherwise. Well, you know what they say. You can't ignore that wolf instinct. You're right. I heard came by here yesterday. Yeah, I picked up on her scent. Is she okay? Yeah, she's still taking punch of death pretty hard. I think they was imprinted on each other. I didn't know. Hmm. Crazy thing is, I don't think she did neither. Think she gonna be okay? I think so. She's young and strong. Just keep an eye on her though. But are you okay? <laughs> Honestly, I ain't recovered since your sister passed. When Elise died, it's like a part of me died with her. I ain't been the same since. Yeah, I feel your pain. Then, it's like, her death is, it's such a mystery. Like, I ain't even got no closure with it. Have you found something out about it? Uh, nah. I heard rumors about her and the human. Those are just rumors. Weezy, at least thought you were dead. And we all did. Man, you know what? When I was out there fighting a vampire, just the thought of a lease was the only thing that made me want to keep going and make it back home. I just wish I would have returned sooner. <laughs> a Weezy, I need you for this war. We suffered a great loss. I need somebody with your skill level on my side. <laughs> but the thing is, I don't fight no more. War done cost me too much. First your sister, and for what? Just to see how I can keep on dying? It's senseless. Well, you can count me out on that. See, it may be senseless to you, but we in it now. We gotta fight for our survival. Our people are dying. Whether you believe in it or not, your people need you. Clay. Reggie, you look like you saw a ghost. What are you doing here? I'm here on official vampire business. There's been some terrible rumors of things going on in your kingdom. Say it's not so, Reggie. What rumors, Clay? There's been allegations of unnatural relations that could be a threat to the existence of our kind. I mean, we are at war with the wolves, so they're the only current threat to our existence. No, not the wolves. I'm talking about abomination. I'm talking about Conigra. What about Conigra? It's been told that she's committed the crime of marrying a human. Do you have any knowledge of that? Conigra? Married to a human? 
It's just crazy. You do realize that lying to the council is punishable by death. Even for a king. I can't believe she's really gone. No, she's not gone. As long as she in our memory, she's with us forever. You're right. Oh, oh, are you okay? What's wrong? Yeah, you gotta go. But I didn't get to say. No, you gotta leave now. Go. I explain later. Bye. Leave now. My lovely niece, Canigra. Clay. I wish this little family reunion was under better circumstances, but I've heard some very terrible rumors about you, but I don't believe them. If you didn't believe them, you wouldn't be here, now would you? It's my job to govern and maintain vampire society. I've heard some rumors that would threaten our very existence. I've done nothing to threaten our existence. So, I guess you get to leave then, huh? It's up to the council to decide what's a threat or not. Come with us. I'm not going anywhere with you. Excuse me? You heard what I said. Mom! I'm not ready. Stay away from her! No, no, no! What is this? The rumors must be true. Oh, no, no, he's nobody. No, 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 no please, 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 no, stop, stop, please, stop! Stop, no, no! no. Why? Humans must not know of our existence. Dad! No, no! Dad? We gotta go. <laughs> Come on. We gotta go now. You birthed the hybrid? Take her. Let go of me. Let go of me. No. 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 Tell y'all a thing of three. It's pronounced ka ni gra. Now subscribe. <laughs> Ooh, I crack myself up. Thanks for watching, because watching me is better than watching TV.